Hang on, Fraser. I'm coming for you. Better than this one expected, yes? Adusa loves it when a plan comes together. This worked out better than I expected. Now, we just have to find Kathad and Freyleth. No, not exactly. This one hoped not to get overpowered by Boss Trenlor's lackeys and flayed alive. After that, I was going to improvise. This is much better, yes. We are in the deep tombs. Kathad is here, somewhere. We should find him. Good. I didn't think these monsters could overpower Kathad. Let's hurry and catch up to him, Five Claw. Convince him to leave. Lothed Clan is no place for a sane and honorable vampire. No place at all. Be cautious, though. If we run into Freylith, remember that she twists words and tells lies that sound like the most beautiful truths. <sighs> Freylith, she... We traveled together a long time ago, before I joined the Raven Watch. She comes and goes. Sometimes I don't see her for decades. Then she appears and, purposely or not, ...causes some amount of... ...havoc. Freyleth made a reappearance when I was first trying to recruit Kathad. She befriended him, lured him away. This one did not realize she was still a part of Kathad's life... ...until Boss Trenlor mentioned her. She may be what drew Kathad back here. It looks like an ancient dwarven prison. But this one has no idea what the dwarves kept down here. Now, Boss Trenlor uses it to hold mortals to feed upon, as well as members of his own clan that displease him. He truly is a monster. Feed me to the blood beast. Tell Boss Trenner I'll pay.
death by Claw. Cathar went down the east corridor. Yeah, I got it. Ah, that blood key. Stay behind me, beloved. Oh, Adusa. What are you doing here? We came to save you, Cathod. Talk to him, Five Claw. I'll watch the door. You and Adusa shouldn't be down here. Boss Trenlor. He's not the sort of vampire who's quick to forgive and forget. I know what Adusa expects of me. I want to join the Raven Watch. I really do. But I can't leave my loathed brothers and sisters in this deplorable state of existence. I need to do something. Boss Trenlor turned this once great clan into a gang of common criminals. He makes us plunder the countryside, kidnap mortals to feed upon. And if anyone objects, he casts us into the deep tombs and denies us blood. He turns us into feral monsters. Freylith has a plan. A way to replace Boss Trenlor and choose a new leader. Someone who wants to improve the Lothid instead of aggrandizing their own position. Once that happens, I can leave. Talk to Freylith. She explains things better than I do. I encountered Adusa shortly after I... changed. She was a true friend. Helped me through the transition. I almost joined the Raven Watch at the time, but Freylith... She thought I should experience more of the world before choosing a direction. Freylith brought me here. She was part of the clan a long time ago and had fond memories of her time with them. Unfortunately, since she left, Boss Trenlor became the clan leader. He welcomed us at first, but then he showed his true colors. Boss Trenlor turned a powerful and respected clan into common criminals. He's abusive, egotistical and cruel. He's also quite insane. Life in the clan has become intolerable, but I had to return. I had to help the clan. I hope Adusa understands. Alright, one second. Thanks, bye. I apologize for my horrid appearance. I assure you, if I wasn't half starved because of that bastard Trenmore, I had to make a much better impression. Will you and Adusa help us save the Lothid clan? Among Boss Trenmore's many vices, he loves to be entertained. So every night they throw him a party, a celebration of blood using a captured mortal, a wild beast, or, or one of the clan he abandoned down here. After we turn feral, of course. Not just evil. Deranged and cruel. He treats our clan as though we were his personal playthings. Toys to be used and abused for... For no other reason than he enjoys it. But he's also powerful. But no one has ever challenged him and survived. If you go down into the blinds and get me a dark cap mushroom, I can use it to weaken Trenlor. Then I can challenge him. After you find it, there's a lift down there. It connects to an abandoned corner in the servants' quarters. We'll meet you there. I am not an alchemist, but I know a thing or two about these darling little mushrooms. When soaked in blood, they release a substance that impinges upon vampiric virility. 
It's the perfect method for dealing with Boss Tremlar. Absolutely. The caves beneath this level are littered with the things. There's a lift nearby that descends to the blinds. But be careful. Boss Trunlor chased the creatures that used to occupy these cells down there. They can be hostile when aroused. For the same reason he sends any of the clan here, I displeased him. When Cathod left, I tried to talk to Trenlor, get them to change. That enraged him, and I hardly believed my eyes when the thought came to rescue me from this horrid hole. That's too long a tale to tell in my current state. Ask me again after I fed. Suffice it to say, Adusa and I ran together a long time ago, before she traded her claws for the life of a noble. As you can tell, we can barely stand each other now. Yeah, I've gotten that in that impression. I am not an alchemist, but I know a thing or two about these darling little mushrooms. When soaked in blood, they release a substance that impinges upon vampiric virility. It's the perfect method for dealing with Boss Trenlor. Strange. This one has never heard of dark cap mushrooms before. I will need to see what they do and bring that information back to the Raven Watch. In the meantime, be on your guard. There's something about Freyleth's plan that doesn't ring true. Yep. Okay, so there's a way over there to get back up. Alright, cool, cool. 